Oh, hello, ladies. I'm Price Burton, and this is my Nano Remo log. Hit about 13,000 words yesterday. Uh, I'm falling a little behind, but uh, I'm still in this. A minute to win it. And today, I'm answering questions. The first question comes from Ted Bordeaux, and he says, "Why do you think? Why do you think? Why do you think about doing all?" The first question comes from Ted Bordeaux, and he asks. What do you think about doing all these ancillary videos? Perhaps it's getting too far away from the original concept of the show. I actually know Ted Bordeaux in real life, and this is not the way he talks, so I'm going to reword. Hey, Jerko, what are you doing all these stupid videos for when I work so hard on these other videos? Uh, actually, this if, if you haven't seen our channel before, we do a scripted show called Price and Claude on the Red Couch. Uh, and there's two other guys who do it, me, Ted Bordeaux, and uh, Claude Langstrom. And we work very, very hard on this. Uh, very hard. Uh, however, uh, we're in between seasons right now. And um, so I decided to do this, a vlog every day on NaNoWriMo. Uh, it actually has to do with Price and Claude because I'm doing a Price and Claude book. Now, I originally intended it to be like an in-between kind of like, uh, you know, side adventure that we have. But it's really becoming like what happened in between season one and season two, so it's becoming more important, I think, in my own head. KS Trek 222 asks, Any chance a book will be autobiographical? She, has, she actually has a couple of questions. Yes, I am Price Burton, and uh, Claude Langstrom in the uh, book is called Price and Claude vs. the Steambots. Now, it's obviously fictional, it's not really autobiographical, but it takes our characters from the scripted show that we do. Our second question is, uh, when can we expect a full-length motion picture? Uh, probably never. I mean, Price and Claude versus Steambots. I mean, you're not gonna, I mean, you know, Spielberg is not gonna call me up and ask for this movie idea. What is that giant paint-by-numbers thing behind you? I originally intended to be uh, one of the Steambots, however, uh, it kind of looks like a big daddy from Bioshock, so back to the drawing board, you know what I'm saying? House Pet Maria asks, Have you ever been published? Uh, no. I've never been published. This is actually uh, the first book that I hope to complete. I actually worked on a book uh, several years ago that, you know, is one of those things where, you know, two years later, oh, how's that book coming? <clears throat> you know, one of those deals. What do you do for a living? Uh, I actually sell hardware at a mom and pop hardware store. Uh, it's been around for almost a hundred years. It's very cool, actually. I got a lot, a lot of fun every day. The Lit Kid asks, write a letter to one of your characters in your book. Uh, this is actually uh, a question done in a video on our uh, We Are Rymo's group. It's a YouTube group for people doing Nano Rymo blogs. And here it goes. Hey, fictitious price. I'm the real price. Hey, fictitious price. Why are you such a pussy? I mean, I know why I'm pussy in real life. It's because I don't want to get beat up for my loud mouth. But you're a fictitious. You know what? I'm actually going to shoot you in the book. Thank you.